Steve Spangler joins us this morning to show us the science behind a fire tornado. Now, typically, Steve, as you know, uh, general, um, what is the definition of a tornado? Is a violently yeah. rotating column of air. You got it. But you, got you can it. do that with a lot of different well, things. You absolutely. And kids are doing it in class. This is just a classic science mm -hmm. toy called a tornado tube. I'm sure you use them when you do your weather programs, you know, when you talk to kids. Yep. Flip that upside down. Uh -huh. The secret here to get the water from the top to the bottom as you swirl is to get those molecules in motion. So there you, you got go. It going? Oh, that's good. That's a good one. Yeah. Go. Look at that right there. There it is. That's good. Watch, it'll take off. <gasps> Look uh, at that. We get that it. vortex that's inside. So as the water comes down, the air comes up, and we get this transfer. Mm -hmm. All right. So we can see the same kind of thing happening in nature, but we can see it from a, a couple different ways. And one of the things that we have to be worried about here in Colorado, and I know it's not fire season yet, but they're right. kind of thinking with all this pine beetle and everything else that's out there, you're hearing the forecast, this uh, whole idea of these forest fires. And what literally happens is the fire can jump from tree to tree, not from the bottom, but from the very top. Okay. So let me show you what this looks like. First of all, put on your safety glasses. It always scares me when so we have. Remember to put that on first time that you were yes. on with me and you made the, the, ex <laughs> the the pumpkin or what was it? The watermelon. Watermelons. You didn't catch on fire, so you're fine. Steve. All right. All right. Oh. So here's what I have: uh, fire extinguisher over here. I've got this uh, the little tray that's here. It's yeah. actually on a little lazy Susan. So as it spins like this, see, Doesn't we just really get the fire much. that rotates. Not right. much at all. So a little rotation from there. <gasps> what we're going to do, however, is we're going to cause the air around there to start to move, uh -huh. and we're going to do that with a screen. So I just have a piece of screen. So okay. the screen's going to go in the middle, and we'll start the whole thing up one more time so you can kind of see what it looks like. Watch okay. what happens here in the middle. Once the screen is there, we actually are catching the molecules. And watch this. You'll wow. That wonderful that fire tornado. Fast. So as it spins like this, now this represents the air going through the trees. And as the air goes through the trees and we get that angular kind of momentum, as they say, you get this incredible fire tornado. And look what happens as it jumps from place to place here on the top. And look at Kyle it's and Gary over there more. thinking that we're roasting marshmallows right. now. Isn't it amazing? <laughs> but by itself, absolutely nothing, nothing at all. Nothing at all. So uh, a weather phenomenon that actually happens uh, with forest fires and something that we need to be worried about a little bit later on this year uh, as we approach fire season. Definitely a dangerous situation, especially for those firefighters and everything yeah. else. So and those glasses look great on you. Thank you. You tell them I'm about the website and I'll be good. Okay? I, you do. You do. Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs>